Hello and welcome to Inside Indiana Business. I'm Gary Dick. The largest uh, Mira Awards event in history is now in the books. Some 1,300 tech professionals, entrepreneurs, educators, and political leaders gathered for the 19th edition of Tech Point's Signature Gala, which spotlights the best in tech in Indiana. Over the next 30 minutes, we will showcase some of the very best uh, Indiana startups, scale-ups, and established tech companies and their creators and their roles in fueling unprecedented tech momentum statewide. Well, Indianapolis is home to the largest Salesforce hub outside of its global headquarters in San Francisco. About 75% of the staff work on the Salesforce marketing cloud, which is headquartered in Indianapolis, and grew nearly 40% year over year in 2017. The tech giant added 200 high wage jobs last year here and celebrated the grand opening of Salesforce Tower. Indianapolis, the tallest building in the state, Salesforce is tech company of the year. What people don't always see is all of the innovation that's happening right here in Indianapolis. It's really strategic to Salesforce as a whole. Um, you know, we're developing a first of its kind integration with Google and a lot of that development work is being done here in Indianapolis. Um, we launched and very innovative to the space, a distributed marketing product that's being developed here as well. And so, um, yeah, very big year for lots of different reasons, but also, you know, really developing a lot of very cool and innovative products to meet our customers' needs. As you reflect back, on how tech has grown and evolved here in a big way. What is here now certainly wasn't here mm -hmm. even just a few years ago. Sure. What are your thoughts on just the evolution of technology in Indiana? Yeah, you know, so what another thing people don't always know is that Indianapolis is actually the second largest hub for Salesforce in the world. Mm -hmm. um, and so I think when you have a company um, with the amazing reputation like Salesforce coming and really putting roots somewhere, um, that starts to pique the interest of a lot of big and small companies say, you know, there must be something really cool going mm -hmm. on there in Indiana. So I think we're seeing that really reflected in a lot of ways. Really reflected of your background. You're from the startup community uh, on through to a big company. I like did. So the Mirror Awards are really cool for me. Yeah. I have now won a been at a company who's won three different times. I go digital, exact target, and now Salesforce. Um, so it's kind of representative of, of my career and, and really a lot of the careers for people at Salesforce right now. Uh, you know, if we've had a lot of people stay through the exact target acquisition. You know, really build a, a career at Salesforce, grow um, very, you know, much professionally and personally. So um, I think there are a lot of really neat stories. Well, TechPoint CEO Mike Langelier joins me now with some perspective on uh, some of the winners in the tech movement uh, as well in Indiana. Mike is always welcome. Thanks, Gary. And congrats on a, on a big event. We'll talk about Salesforce in a minute, but yeah. first of all, the event. Yeah. Uh, last year was big, mm -hmm. 900 plus. You get 1,300 uh -huh. packed house, biggest uh, e event ever, biggest crowd ever. What does that say about technology in Indiana? The Miro Awards is always a tell every year for the strength and vitality of the, the ecosystem. And so last year, you know, coming out of last year, we expected 1,000 people. The awards sold out two months ahead of time. So we had to expand it and, and find space for 1,300, which is exciting. What's also exciting, though, is that um, is not only the, the attendee volume, but the volume of applications. So we had over 200 applications, which is twice what it was five years ago. It's seven times what it was 10 years ago. And that is always a tell for how both the quantity of the applications and the strength of the applications g give us a sense of, of how strong the ecosystem is. And for it to see it continue to build over time is a really, really good, um, a really, really strong indication. The other thing that's a really strong indication is that when you look at who was, rep who was, who was helping to, to sponsor the award, like we, we had three tech companies, three pillar companies in Salesforce, Angie's List, and Infosys that are backing those awards as pillars right. here, and Ice Miller as also the platinum sponsor, as just these, these, these key uh, organizations mm -hmm. that are pillars here that are uh, helping to support it and make it possible. Let's talk about Salesforce. Everybody knows the Salesforce name. A lot of people maybe uh, don't realize 2017 was a huge year for the company. A lot of that innovation, a lot of that activity right here in Indiana. Yeah, uh, people could, oftentimes people can think, well, Salesforce is so visible, um, and, and as as a result, this was a no-brainer. But really, 2017 was a, was a, was an exceptional year, as you, as you said. Uh, they crossed the marketing cloud, which is headquartered here. It's a, you know, this is a huge global company, one of the largest uh, enterprise uh, SaaS companies in the world. Um, their, uh, that marketing cloud crossed a billion dollars in revenue and grew 40% year over year, which is tremendous growth when you're talking about that scale. Yeah, I only got about 30 seconds, but to have the name on the t top of the state's tallest building mm -hmm. be Salesforce. Yeah. 
It has been remarkable to see the external attention and validation that that has brought. Mm -hmm. uh, and what I've loved about Salesforce is that they have embraced that role. Uh, they've, they've been prominently outspoken, whether that's via social media mm -hmm. or, uh, pro, or, or participating in um, events with other companies and attracting other companies. They're, they're willing to embrace that role both by taking the building and then also playing a, playing yeah. a, marketing, uh, play, playing a prominent marketing presence. All right, Mike, uh, Mike, stick with us. You're going to stay with us for the first half hour with more reactions, so sit tight.